It's a production that's literally taken a lifetime to witness, if you're South Asian. For the first time ever, a major studio, Disney, is producing an animated series, Mira Royal Detective, featuring a cast of characters that are all South Asian, entirely voiced by established and up-and-coming South Asian talent. It's, uh, it's been a long time coming. We really needed this. To see Indian culture being celebrated in such a massive way is uh, it's actually it's making me speechless. This is going to change so much. It's exhilarating to be in a time and a moment with Disney where this is happening. Mira Royal Detective is being made with young children in mind, yet the creators of the show are going out of their way to make sure this is more than just a cartoon, but a real lens into the rich cultural heritage of India and South Asia. The talent and all of our friends who are working on the show of every background and there's finally it's not just this generic brown Indian like they're specific. It's going to normalize being what it is to being a South Asian in America. Actress Frida Pinto is the voice of Queen Shanti who's so impressed with eight-year-old Mira's sleuthing skills she names her royal detective. Leela Ladner is the voice of Mira. I'm really excited for young kids to grow up, you know, seeing themselves represented, but also normalizing our culture and embracing diversity. Disney made a major move in India recently through the acquisition of a large group of media assets. So developing Mira is no coincidence. And it doesn't hurt that the Indian American community is the fastest growing demographic in the US. We're at a time, I think, culturally and politically, where we really need to be celebrating diverse cultures, and so it comes, it's coming at the perfect moment. It's felt really wonderful to have a show that celebrates who you are and makes it both fantastic and also just regular. Just regular people having amazing, you know, experiences and following mysteries with ledus. <laughs> Please pay for your purchases and get out and come again. The most famous portrayal of Indians in cartoons was convenience store owner Apu on The Simpsons. Sensibilities have changed tremendously since that character was created. A white guy doing an impression of a white guy making fun of my father. For comedian Hari Kondabolu, who produced a documentary called The Problem with Apu, this project is an enormous milestone for the community. The idea that we can have cartoon characters that represent our culture and that we're voicing them is such a big deal. So uh, it's really like, you know, I think for some of us it's kind of emotional. This is a big day. I am reminded of that ache in my heart as a child of wanting to watch a show like this and feel valid, feel like I fit in. Actress Karen David voices three characters on the show and believes Mira will do more than just showcase South Asia's vibrant colors, singing, and dancing. At the end of the day, it's about kindness and compassion and empathy and about a young girl that wants to help those in need. And I hope that inspires a lot of young boys and girls to, to want to help and become more proactive in their communities, in their neighborhoods. Mira Royal Detective has already received a renewal for season two. Season one premieres March 20th on Disney Junior. For the Atini Spotlight with Carrie Lane, I'm Deepthi Dower from Disney Studios in Southern California.